UMNO Deputy President Mohamed Hassan has called on his party to remain steadfast on the lane of moderation and urge immediate action to win over the hearts and minds of the Malay youth. He said it is not easy to present the path of moderate politics while extremist right-wing ideologies, race and religious rhetoric are easy to exploit to garner popularity. He said this following the party's loss at the Kamaman by-election in the past stronghold of Terengganu last weekend. Although difficult, Muhammad is still optimistic and believes that reclaiming the trust of the Malays is not impossible. According to him, this mission would require spirit, strategy, leadership and patience. He pointed out that the by-election showed that AMNO is still unable to resonate with the youth demographic, whose rejection of the party is becoming consistent. On a broader view, he suggested that what happens in Kamaman stays in Kamaman and that the by-election is not reflective of the aspirations of Malaysians in other parts of the nation. He acknowledged the defeat but said PN did not kill AMNO and at another time, there will surely be a victory for AMNO. Terengganu Menteri Besar Ahmad Samsuri Mokta had retained the seat for pass, beating BN candidate Raja Mohammad Afandi Raja Mohammad Noor with a majority of more than 37,000 votes.